new tonight, the worst of COVID-19 may be behind us, but many nonprofits are still struggling to bounce back from pandemic losses. Meals on Wheels is now in desperate need of volunteers. The Fox Carolina's Kennedy Harris talked with them today, and Kennedy, how many volunteers are they down? Well, Tori, they're down 50 meal delivery drivers right now. On average, they need 140 volunteers a day. 50 volunteers is 50 routes, so they've had to adjust the way they serve to keep people fed. They're hoping more volunteers will step up soon. All right, I'll go up and I'll deliver. Good morning, sir. Don Vandersloot has been a Meals on Wheels volunteer since 2014. I don't like to use the R word, but I'm no longer employed. And uh, quite frankly, I needed, I wanted something to do, and I thought it would be nice to have something to do that kind of gave back. Normally, he delivers two days a week, but lately he's picking up extras. I've been here almost four years, and this is the biggest kind of shrinkage I've seen. Muriel Taylor says they lost many regular volunteers after COVID-19. Others dropped out after gas prices grew, and some do one route and don't come back. So feeding 1,500 people in Greenville County, has gotten harder. They have about 50 routes short staffed. That's about 500 people without a hot meal drop off each day. They might get a hot and a frozen meal on Monday because we don't have a volunteer for their route on Tuesday. Uh, and that's not what we want to do. We want to feed everybody a hot meal every day because not only is the meal important, the interaction uh, with our volunteers is crucial to their overall mental and physical well being as well. Some deliveries are to the front door. Some are to the back door. Just meeting the people and uh, everybody's appreciative and everybody's thankful and uh, uh, I just like to see the people. The organization has used DoorDash delivery drivers for free, but that's only a temporary solution. Next year, they'll have to pay for the dashers to help. That's why they're asking you to step up. We can't do what we do without our volunteers. So for that, we're super grateful. We just need additional ones to come on out and join us. And if you're interested in volunteering, you can sign up online. You work days and routes that best fit your schedule. And routes can last from 30 to an hour long. We'll have the link to sign up on foxcarolina.com.